Oh. Good evening, chat. Sorry for um starting late today. I uh, I was working on something. Let me get the uh, game hooked up, audio and all that. Channel mainstay right here. Can the game like actually fucking work? What? What's going on? I had to, uh, mix smullen my shit before it would, uh, capture. What the hell? Center horizontally. A little that way. Here we go. <sighs> We are using the composite variant of the uh, Blargs filter this time. Rather fond of that one. My back's acting, acting up, so I'm going to take some of the uh, oil. How are we doing, by the way? How much left? Still slightly over a third of the bottle. Nice. Akemi Nakajima, programming genius, invented a demon summoning program. But after gaining physical bodies, the demons Loki and Set attacked the summoner. He was saved by a mysterious transfer student, Yumiko Shirasagi. Nakajima and the magic-wielding Yumiko joined forces and repelled the demons. A tale as old as time, really. Hang on, let me, uh... There we go. Now it shouldn't uh, pause whenever I tab out to go look at something. All right, here we go. Yep, there's my usual dose. Yeah. Digital Devil Story, Megami Tensei. Right where it all began. Hang on. All right, no more distractions. Let's just go with uh, bland ass normal uh, names. Here we go. Well, let me just uh, real quick.
Recommended stats. Here we go. All right, all right. So let's see. One, two, there. Yep, that should be a good spread for Nakajima's stats. Yes. Yep, should be decent. Here we are again. Mecom City on the top floor of Daedalus Tower. The game's about to become a pain in my ass again. Fucking remember that time I like accidentally walked directly into the boss fight? Genuinely kind of fucking hilarious. <laughs> All right, item equip. Here we go, hand. This time, I think I'm not going to be a pussy, and I'm just going to start using save states. Because uh, it's an emulator, and this game's a pain in my ass. Now, if you'll remember, we were, uh... We were significantly, uh... Like, almost halfway through the game. Uh, back before I lost my save file. No! Hell yeah. All right, so we have two points. Let's just giga specialize for a while. New spell acquired. Hell yeah. I fucking forget. Where everything is. Please. Ha! 
Time to kick some ass. Bro was not willing to cooperate. Ooh, Soma, that's a decent item. Hell yeah. So that goes down. I don't want to go down yet. No, excuse me, what? I don't remember you. Negotiation is key when recruiting demons. Uh, yeah, thanks. I knew that. Go down the stairs? Hell yeah, brother. I should really make time to watch, like, a movie or something soon. I've been slacking on, uh, actually, like, watching shit. Which is a failing on my part. Mostly. Oh, fucked up an evil blob. Nice. Oh! Woman injured. We need to leave. I swear to fucking god, doors, like, spawn enemies sometimes. Like, they always pop out when you're going through a door, it's annoying. Hell yeah. And of course, there's no items that uh, revive party members. No, that'd be insane. You kidding me? You are healed. Yeah, there we go. Let's get a little uh, armor going. That might be good. Yep, here we go. I do not have money for armor. I should have considered buying armor back uh, before I blew it all on weapons. Ah, it'll be fine. We'll just go down there, kill a few enemies, get Yumiko up to speed. Yes, we're going down. So today I woke up and for some reason I thought it was Friday. Like for some reason known only like for some reason unknown to man or God. I thought it was Friday when I got up today. Motherfucker! Another level up, huh? 
Do I have items that I can revive? Cannot use that. No, I do not have items that I can revive. I may be experiencing a skill issue of some kind. I don't know. I, I, I might be I might be having some technical difficulties. Yes, bring me back up there. This game looks phenomenal with the uh, filter on, by the way. Like, uh, I've changed a few settings, primarily um, setting it so that it's not using integer scaling anymore, so it fills the entire thing. I have it set to fill a 4x3 monitor while maintaining the aspect ratio, which is why it fills the entirety of my second monitor now. And it, it actually fills the entire screen. I can actually see. I can see and look at what I'm, like, you know, playing. And I can be expected to actually be able to read the text. It's great. I'm experiencing a nose moment. And, like, I feel like I'm going to sneeze. But I also feel like I'm not going to sneeze. It's bothering me. Come on. <laughs> Here we go. Uh oh, oh. There we go. Oh. Welcome to Nose Noises. Brand new se uh brand new uh segment for the channel. Very uh very beautiful, very powerful. Hang on, I'm getting lost in the sauce. Yep, yep, here we go. Here we go. You guys see those, uh, silly, silly memes, uh, people have been making now that, um, Leon from Fortnite, uh, Leon from, uh, Resident Evil 4 is in Fortnite. Uh, my favorite one is where they edited a, uh, cutscene where he's getting monologued at by a villain. Like, a, in, like, the little, uh, Metal Gear Solid Kodak-ass, uh, thing. But instead of, like, staring blankly into the camera like he does in the actual game, he's fucking filing his nails, because that's apparently an emote in Fortnite. And that's, like, unironically, for real, actually fucking hilarious to me. Oh no. I might have a problem. Uh, the, the floor one enemies should be easier. We should grind there. I should have eaten before stream. Oh no. That's ah, fine. I'll just eat more afterwards. He's just sending us back. Let me just, uh... Let's get the death counter out already. Fade that right on in. 
So we need about a hundred. 180 for a set of armor, right? Should be as easy as just walking back and forth. Actually, you know what? Going through doors repeatedly should be fine. Here we go. Woman injured. Hell yeah. Yeah, I believe the uh, highest a stat can go in this one is 40. So, like, uh, you put 30 points into a skill, and then it's done. It's all, it's all maxed out. Here we go. Eh, you know what, just fucking... No, 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 we, we need the money more. There we go. And then we're not going down to the next, uh, level. Until both of our dudes have, um, some manner of armor. Because I don't want to get fucking killed in three seconds. Like, you fucking saw how it was, uh, down there. The enemy looked at me wrong, and I fucking died. Level up Nakajima, hell yeah. Level up Yumiko, hell yeah. <laughs> oh. oh dear. I did not mean to sneeze that powerfully. My bad. Might uh, dump a couple uh, points into um, strength on Yumiko just to get the uh, default attack more powerful. Oh sure, I think we're gonna, we can afford one set of armor. Get our ass up there, get that shit paid for. Where, oh where, there it is. Oh, well, that's, that's only 140, nice. We are now out of money. All right, so yeah, that's the quick hotkey for that. Let's get the uh, armor on Yumiko because she's more prone to getting fucking bodied for no goddamn reason. All right, here we go. Now, bear in mind, this is not going to be a 100% run. I, I legit just want to fucking beat the game. If that means grinding until every uh, stat is maxed out, I don't care. I'll do it. I'm just that guy, you know? Actually, these two rooms should be uh, guaranteed spawns. 
Oh yeah, here we go. Nice of them to put two guaranteed spawn rooms right next to one another. Are you fucking kidding me? I fucking hate these stupid little magic men. Alright, attack, magic, heal him. I need to get his ass some armor now. Vast amount of wealth, holy shit. Let's get his ass some armor right the fuck now. I've been uh I've been considering uh covering uh one of those wizardry games as of late. But I really only want to jump into it on stream if I can find a uh, very nice, fun uh, scenario. Because most scenarios are like a pain in my ass. And that's uh, not exactly ideal. You know? All right. Here we go. We're slightly better prepared for the dungeon this time. Let's get back in there. You know, I, I'm hoping at some point uh, when they release the uh, scenario editor, I can like do a few streams just going in and making uh, scenarios for wizardry because I think that'd be really fun my tummy's grumbling oh no oh no Hell yeah. Now we're talking. Look at that. Armor's working wonders. <laughs> oh. Oh, Yumiko leveled up. All right. Yumiko learned a new spell. Hell yeah. Oh, that's a lot of money. I I can probably get a better uh bit of equipment with that. Eh, you know what? Just what's up, man? Well, at least you didn't try to cave my fucking skull in. Sometimes that's the best you can really hope for. All right, let's go over here. Kill! Here we go. Oh no, two damage. How am I gonna recover from that? No! Huh. <sighs> Uh, apologies if I seem uh, a bit lower energy today. I uh, woke up a bit late. And uh, had to do a lot of extra work before stream. Here we go. Let me just check some things real quick. Here we go.
<laughs> Ooh. Ah. Big ol' stretch. Hell yeah. All right, let's see. That's a level up. All right, let's get some better armor. Remember, chat, there's no protection like more protection. There we go. Oh, you can check the uh, magic there. That's useful. What does the treasure do, though? Probably for quest items. Eh, you know what? Real quick, let's check if there's any better uh, weapons we can get. Uh, no. Well, really, I suppose all that's left is just get down there. We have everything we can get. All that's left is just uh, go, leave. Set out on our silly little quest. Plenty of money for negotiation now, so... Probably get to work on picking up some demons. That sound good to you? It sounds good to me. I've spoken to this man before. <laughs> really? Here we go. Demon acquired. Up. Oh, I forgot. This go this weaves up and down and up and down and now we're on the outer side of a uh, floor 1. Configuration. Battle messages are fast. Here we go. Minotaur is on the one, f the first floor of this tower. He's directly below this room. Thanks, little guy. Oh boy. I would honestly kind of love to see them uh, do a full, like, you know, full HD uh, hand-drawn remake of this game. Dank-ass tree. What's up, my man? Fuck it, let's just kill him.
Why is the dog going ape up there? Play it safe. There we go. Notice how we have not gotten a single damaging spell yet, by the way. Absolutely dog shit. Fucking evil. Fucked up and crazy and evil. Let's get in here. Actually, you know what? About an hour and we'll uh, change games. Fuck it. What time are we at? 42? Yeah, that's fine. Oh, you know what? Here, I will, uh, I'll go up and I'll save. I'll go up, I'll save. I'll put on the older preview of the, um, Fear and Hunger video that I, uh, premiered just the other day. When I come back, take a few minutes... Change game. Finish out the other hour. Because I'm hungry. Like, I'm hungry. I'm going to take... About 10 minutes or so. Uh, make a grilled cheese. It'll be good. And I'll come back. I'll have a nice big round and full tummy. And then I can uh, be your problem again for an hour. What? What the fuck is that dog doing? There's a dog upstairs and he's uh barking, he's yelling. That boy is speaking. Here we go. Oh man, I have so much editing to do tonight. Oh, that's going to be fucking awful. All right. Let's uh yeah, kill that for now. Yep, here we go. Media source. Yep, here we go. That This is a 10-minute video. The following program may contain... I'll see you soon. ...depictions of gore, violence, substance abuse, self-harm, and sexual violence. Viewer discretion is advised.
Let's jump into it, I suppose. I believe his name in canon is Enki, so I will go with that. Okay. Well, hard mode seems like a pain in the dick. Let's go in on fear and hunger mode. Hey, from uh, from the editing chair here, I would like to clarify what I'm doing with this intro. The intro serves twofold. To establish your character and to uh, g assign your starting skills. The choices I make here will matter most because there are a couple skills you're going to want to write off the bat when starting out in this game. The first choice I made, which is uh, choosing whether or not to stab your sister in the back, uh, if you choose not to, you gain mastery over insects, which uh, has various perks that show up throughout the game, primarily talking to vermin and insects. Yeah, the second choice will be to either set the temple on fire or leave. If you choose to leave, you gain the first volume of Alchemilia, which will teach you the herb crafting um, recipes as well as a prerequisite for a later skill that is immensely useful. The third choice I am offered is to pick a god to pray to. I chose to pray to Grow Goroth so that gaining spells from him will be easier. And finally, there is a choice to stock up on something. I choose to simply run a rush straight to the dungeons as it allows me to learn dash which greatly increases your walking speed on the map which is huge as enemies are not random encounters you can see them on the map so being able to uh for lack of a better term juke them is a great boon you'll see more editing uh intrusions later on but for now let's get you back into real time uh r running back in after um finishing <laughs> after finishing uh editing out the uh rest of the first session of gameplay uh an important thing i skipped over is that if you chose to strike your dagger into your sister's spine during the intro you will gain necromancy trick which is phenomenal, phenomenal. Extremely useful, actually. And then if you choose to set fire to the temple, you will gain Pyromancy Trick, which is a powerful magic spell. Necromancy allows you to uh, raise the dead, which is great for um, gaining more party members early on. Uh, my build is, speci is specifically for getting to uh, a character named Lagarde Fast, I should have clarified that uh, during my initial addendum here, and that's my fault. I'm truly sorry for failing you. Let's get you back into real time now. Yep, here we go. We go dirt hell yeah dirt looks like feces smells like feces oh yeah Fecal funny time. I have to hurry up if I want to save Lagarde. If 
five tinder boxes. Leather vest, nice. Glass vial, nice. Twelve silver coins, nice. Cabbage, nice. Optimize, there we go. Oh. Oh, thank fucking God. Please, please. Hell yeah. What? <laughs> oh, that's funny. Ah. Foot injured. Worm juice. What the fuck is that? Mild poison that aids is said to kill parasites and worms inside the host body. Nice. Two tomatoes. Tomatoes. Oh, I'm bleeding. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's a penis. That's a penis. Oh. Cog spotted. Oh. I don't like this. I, I, I am uncomfortable with this. <laughs> please, please. I took out his fucking head. Well, now that I know that I can kill them. Nice cock, bro. Please, 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 please. Nice cock. Perfect. Oh. Do I have anything that will heal me? Oh. I appear to have died. Cock injured. <laughs> oh, fuck, man. Oh, that sucks. I I wasn't I wasn't expecting penis that soon in the game actually. Legit not expecting cock. Cock jump scare. All right, I'm back, I'm back. Mm. Mm. Let's uh, cut back over here. Hell yeah.
let me just turn off my phone because I can hear myself through it. Yeah, here we go. There we go. There we go. Huh? Mmm. Mmm. Love that grilled cheese. All right, let's uh fix all my windows and then decide what to do for the next hour. Let's open up Steam. Yep, open up my Steam library. Uh, 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 uh. Mm. Hang on, I know what to do. We're back here again. When did I turn fucking cash pulp off? Oh. Damn. All right. All right. Let's uh go over here, get things set up. M V Hell yeah. Okay, done. Open up YouTube. All right, YouTube, music. Yeah, shuffle the splatter soundtrack. Here, here we go. Hang on, I think, uh, I think Chatterino is having trouble. Let's restart that. In the meantime, get the, uh, database open. Here's our lovable test party member, Herbie. You may be wondering, oh, why are there so many states? You're going to find out, brother. Let's 
So let's start by, um... Finishing out naming these. Oh, I'm feeling it. All right. The user oh. No. A light beyond light. There we go. Alright, before we start naming spells, let's finish out uh, adding descriptions to the ones I have. It's kind of loud and it's distracting me, so I'm going to turn it down a bit. Now, now I can think. Now I can think, yeah. Actually... Let's get the smart people glasses on. Here we go. The shit I have to do just to get, uh... Just get the damn game uh, to capture. Looking and peeking at shit on my other monitor real quick. All right, here, here we go. All right, here we go. There we go. The user's fingers mutate into syringe-like appendages for injecting a green substance. The user beams a cry for help out into the stars, welcoming a form of assistance from elsewhere. Yep, here we go. Skill type, yeah, yeah, here we go. Oh 
Let me just double check what doping actually is. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Biology of the target to naturally produce performance enhancing drugs. There we go. The user makes the target weak by both lowering blood pressure and inducing anemia. Here we go. The user The user alters their vocal cords so as to enable greater musical ability. Make sure to save. Check stuff real quick. Here we go, here we go. At some point, I really gotta pick up a copy of, uh... At some point, I really gotta pick up a copy of, uh, Theatre Them Final Fantasy, uh, Final Bar Vine. Uh, no, Final Bar Line. Uh, I want to get the, um, Special Edition because I really love the series. Okay, okay. The user induces a temp temporary mutation in the target to grow talic components consistent with cybernetic augmentation. Might as well change, change where that uh, breaks off. There we go. 
that targets one ally. Actually, let me just, for a time, yeah, and that corresponds to this state. Remove it, battle end. Duration and turns, that's gonna be three turns. Yeah, so you get that, you take, you can, uh, attack, you attack two more times than you would normally. Here we go. The user. Induces a form of mental simplification within the target disabling potential ability use Now let's move this down. So copy. Move this down uh, to 30. It's not a skill that really does anything. It's just a divider. So it should be fine. Here we go, here we go. Just checking some stuff on the side, don't worry about it. Yeah. Looks like someone's streak is breaking today, actually. Um, usually Barley Parley is here. Let's go with a, uh, yeah. Let's go with a higher tier fire spell. Bio Napalm. All right, so let's see. B, HP, times 50% minus B, magic defense, times two. That should work. I 
All right, so yeah, add state. Burnt. That's gonna be a 50%. Crack the sky. It's gonna be fire type as well. Copy that. Steam, I don't need to know that my friend is playing fucking Terraria. Tell me when they're playing a good game instead. Here we go. Yeah, check some shit. Oh, I'm having a nose moan again. Awful, terrible. Yep, here we go. Let's go with uh, another ice spell. Yeah, here we go. Oh, I know. The Everest. I'm trying to avoid like basic shit like fireball, you know? I want to make sure that the uh, experience of like figuring out what the fuck a spell does is more than just staring at the um, more than just staring at the uh, thing. Here we go. Drop in the bucket. Ebb and flow, yeah, that'll work. Water. What's next? Sculpt, all right. Chisel. There we go. Of course, I'm going to make uh, enemies that are, like, straight up immune to certain elements because I'm fucked up and evil.
two random enemies. Two random enemies. No, this is gonna be two. This is gonna be another one of the two random enemies. One. This is gonna be uh, all enemies. And this is Earth type, so it gets uh, a chance to add statuesque. Which is basically a uh, petrification, but I made it sound cooler. Here we go, getting distracted again, getting distracted again, getting distracted again. Ooh. Uh, it's not like anyone's fucking paying attention. Whatever, it's Thursday. Here we go. Alright, so now is Dust Devil. Twister. This one's gonna be uh, two random enemies again. Paste. Yep, here we go. May we bring up psych? We got a hack. You collect, select, show me your best at Mr. Twister. It's all over now. So we can use, we need more candy cans. Uh, yeah, here we go. Wind, there we go. Radiance. I don't know, that's that's going to get taken wrong because this is the world we live in now. Oh, I, I fucking know. No, here, here we go. No, that's gonna be a space type. Uh... Yep, here we go. That's going to have a one percent chance to instantly kill. Wait, why? No, 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 no. Death. Where's the skills tab? There it is. We're going to make it. We're going to. We're going to make it.
Yes, we need darkness, blood, and space. Hmm. There we go. Let's get, yep, here we go. Here we go. I fucking love this track. Uh, which session is this? 12, System Blower. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, yeah. There we go. You know what? Yeah, fuck it. Let's throw that in there. Why not? Then I'll change this to a plus since it's recovery. Yeah, here we go. HP damage. One ally. Uh, congratulations on having the fastest hands in the West, Sammy. I'm just working on a game. Yeah, one ally. Element, blood, there we go. A dot M A T. Let me just check. That's, yep, that's the, uh... By O point, you know, yeah, so this is going to do half, half the user's magic attack minus B plus, no, B M D F times two. So it's going to do very low damage. Regener yeah. Regenerative therapy. And this is going to give um other EX parameter, yeah, H, H, HP regeneration, 10%, or by turn end, duration between 50 and 10 turns. 
between five and ten turns, so that's either half health regeneration or full health regeneration. I hope you've been having a great day, uh, Sammy. I've just been uh, working on some frankly boring shit. All right, let's bump up to the silver tier space type. Oh shit, you're very sleepy, huh? If you do end up falling asleep during this, I hope you have a very nice rest. Actually, how does the, uh, Welcome Moon and Star work? Okay, so it's roughly the same as everything else in this one. All right. Okay, okay. Here, let me approve your redeem. There we go. Double check if I were to end it now. There would be no one I'm particularly interested in raiding, unfortunately. Yeah, I started late because I was um, editing something that's kind of important. You'll probably see it within the next few days. Uh, no spoilies. I, I have to work on it more after a uh, stream anyways. <laughs> uh. But uh, yeah. So let's uh, all enemies. This should have been all enemies too. I'll fix that. All right, let's see. I'm thinking. All right, so the first tier of space magic was welcome moon and star. Ah, uh, shit. I don't know what to call this one. Oh. Ah, shit, I can't decide. Hmm. trying to think I'm trying to think the, the problem with uh game development even if it's just for fun is that you'll hit hitches like this where you don't know what the fuck to do like everything else was easy and this is for some reason extremely difficult Ah, oh, fuck it. Meteor. Let's name some of the physical skills and then, uh, probably make some, uh, more room for them. Actually, no, let's make more room for the physical skills now. There we go, we have enough for 10. We could also... Uh... 
One, two, three, four, five. We could also add five more magic spells. Here we go. The problem I'm facing right now is that, um, like, I, I want to make the, uh, magic overpowered because the cost of casting it is that, um, you have to take an extra turn to, uh, basically use an item that will temporarily grant you the, uh, spell you want to use, which takes up your entire turn. However, I also don't want it to be, like, way too fucking strong. Like, I'm running into a game... a game design conundrum. Uh, let's just uh, add the uh, cast messages and then decide on shit like that at a later date. Oh. All right, let's see. Here we go. I like uh, giving the uh, spells cool cast uh, messages because it, it's like nice. Like uh, for example, you cast a, you cast something like uh, doping, and the description says something like the user manipulates the the biology of the target to naturally produce performance enhancing drugs. And you're like, oh, that's definitely a buff. And you cast it and it just says, Rush of Blood, Scent of Murder. It's great. It's phenomenal. Alright, the fluid burns you as much as the enemy. Like fine china scattered to the ground. There's only cold here. All right. Okay, okay. One wave crashes to the other. In motion. Find the beauty extracted from the earth. Yeah, there we go. No, 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 fucking twister. There's no place like home. The light of heaven refined. There we go. Yeah, 
Skip, here we go. Here we go. Let's also give this. Uh, add state. Death. Let's make this one 2%. So it has a 2% chance to ma instantly kill an enemy. go oh yeah 100 percent add state regenerative therapy there we go now when this is used on an ally it will apply regenerative regenerative therapy for a few turns What was the message for this one? No, no, no. Fuck. Epic. Final Fantasy VII reference. Here we go. Should probably, uh... Apply these as, um... Hit type, uh, magic. So that they're not just 100% pure damage, you know? Here we go. The only one that really needs to be a certain hit is the uh, healing and uh, buff spells. Here we go. Now we're talking. Yeah, apply that. Uh, oh yeah, last night my uh, I got a better chair. Like my chair doesn't suck anymore. This is nice. I received a better chair. There's no one I really want to raid right now, and I'm kind of tired. So I think I'm going to uh, wrap up. I apologize. I apologize for today being a bit of a slower day. Uh, tomorrow's Friday, so we should be doing Gungrave. Yeah, I think I got a good bit done. I'll have to uh, do more on this later. And I also have editing to do for uh, for uh, something else afterwards. Hell yeah. So, 
I don't need to get the um, schedule out for this. I know what I'm going to do tomorrow. I'm going to be doing Gungrave tomorrow. And then uh, on... And then Saturday and Sunday, I'm taking off. I will try to have the schedule for next week up tomorrow evening at the latest. Uh, I don't have anyone I want to raid, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna log out now. Uh, thank you for showing up, even if you didn't show up for a while. And I hope you have a good night. See ya.